we're going out. Yes, a when the world is up, this is Arkman checking in. Come to you with another vlog. Today is Sunday, 14th of November. Papunta tayo ngayon ng green belt and then we're going to do a little bit of hopping. Yeah. Right now, kasi I decided to go late afternoon because I had a meeting with the group uh, for strategy class and ngayon kailangan nating pumunta ng Gloria at tumita pa the So, we're gonna go somewhere eh. So, hindi lang siya sa Glorieta per se. So, isusubukan din tayo ng restaurant. Probably get a two cents on a resto na itatry namin. To know what it is at kung uh, malaman, uh, anta para malaman din yung review ko, opinion ko about the place, watch until the end. Dito na ako sa Greenbelt, so labas pa naman tayo So, interesting enough Sinabi ko dun sa taxi na baba tayo ng Greenbelt 3 Pinaba niya ako sa Greenbelt 2 Kanina traffic nga naman Hindi nga lang, unti-unti na tayong pabalik ng normal yeah. So, okay Ang gagawin natin ngayon sa Greenbelt kasi Actually, dito ako nagpababa Dahil kailangan natin mag-ocular I have to look for a restaurant kasi kung saan Parang tatanggap sila ng Parties. May get together or plan to get together because we're mga kasama ko na different from other departments. Yeah, we're going to um, sit down and preferably on Friday. Because for some of our friends, we're going to be able to spend our time on the 13th month pay. Spend it wisely. And for our friends, we're going to be able to spend our time on the 13th month pay. Spend it wisely. And for our friends, we're going to be able to spend our I have a couple of restos in mind. Ikot lang tayo sa ano, Green Belt. Tingin natin kung bukas yung Tipodo, Ikoryo. Check na natin yung mga nandito sa labas. Torch. At least madami tayo na ano, choices ang pagpipilihan. Kasi so, you know me, pagdating sa pagkain at saka sa kukilar, apparently, I'm a go-to guy. Comes with the name, comes with the brand. That's so cute. So, and the parang four different animals kasi siya. Tapos they're giving away cotton candy for free. Well, sure, that is it is the season. So, parang alam mo, kung tiyan tiyan kasi buwan balik mga tao dito. Yeah, one way or the other, kailangan mo kasi ng stimulate ng economy. Any more lockdowns? Any more alert levels? Sa makakaran ng restrictions kasi. Ako, I'm convinced that the economy will collapse. Pag gintong pang ginagawa nila. Ang dami na mga businesses, ang dami na nga um, naging changes. Yeah? So, um, if we can't stimulate the economy, babagsak at babagsak din yung ngayon natin. Value ng peso. Bababad, ito tatasin ng presyo ng goods and services. So, you don't know all that stuff. We take up your economics. Tingin-tingin na muna dahil kasi nagbubuka tayo ng funds. Some of my biggest expenses would probably also include din kasi yung pagpapakabit ng bagong internet if we move to the new place. So, iniiwasan na muna natin yung unnecessary na budol. Yeah. Saka na siguro pag malapit ng Pasko. I also have to set budget din para dun sa regalo para sa family. So, here's where it is. It is the season for commercialism. <laughs> commercialism. There are so many people, hindi ako makakuha ng mask na ha. Ito, yung escalator shot ka doon ng Casey Neistat. Yeah, dude. Very interestingly enough, kailangan ito eh, para ano, stimulate ang economy. So, a couple of restaurants I have in mind is nasa Green Belt 5, tapos, try natin din mag-ikot sa Glorieta. Yeah, never fail kasi dito, mga pre-parties, chilies, mga ganon. Yan, kumukha naman ng mga yun eh. Pero it's just a matter of ilan yung papasukin nila Tapos yung iba You have no choice but to go al fresco Kaya lang, dito na natin tayo Tingnan na rin natin So, ang policy niya no Policy ni Ipodo I actually just went from Ipodo um, Pwede naman daw, basta mag-confirm ka ng reservation They're going to hold for 15 minutes For a big party Tapos kung um, Paano ba? Dahil kasi peak yun eh So Friday dinner Diba? So, super peak siya. Kaya ganun lang din yung limitation na bibigay nila. Kung wala ka doon 15 minutes, they're going to give the table to somebody else. It'll be forfeited. So, that's fair. I mean, that's fair. Uh, ngayon, punta tayo ng 5. Uh, so, 
I just can't get over na <laughs> sabar na dami tao ngayon, no? Yeah. Kailangan mo talaga i-stimulate ng economy, eh. One way or the other naman, babalik na tayo sa naman. So, as for me, we look for other restaurants. Kailangan madami tayong choices. Buti pa sa pagkaya, madami choices. What? Hindi pa lang, gano'n may ka-quick stop din sa, no? Sa H&M if ever, dahil I need to buy new joggers. Kaya yeah, gotta buy new drip para din sa world record attempt. No drip, eh, no? Pero bibili lang ako ng black joggers. Though mainit siya, iniisip ko kasi, pag black yung sinote mo kasi na damit. Parang pag may mga manchaw yung mga sauce ng pagkain, pag kumapit siya sa damit mo, kasi hindi siya masyado makita, di ba? Para pag nagpa-picture, hindi nakaki. <laughs> Things you learn over the years, man. Over the years. Tapos sa tapang atawa ka pa, no? sinubukan mo pa magsuot ng black sa Pilipinas, sa init dito. <laughs> God damn, man. Okay, pasok muna tayo. Pasok, pasok. Pusip ko, paano ko ito? No? Problema na kasi sa ganito dahil kasi sobrang nipis kasi niya. Pronto chafing po. No? So, mga madaling masira if ever. Alam mo yung pag nag-rub sa files mo. Lag naman ako siguro sa labas, baka makapiray tayo eh. Mark safe from Budol. Tsaka ano ito? Nung tinitingan ko yung mga selection, yung material, it's either makapal na wool, yung material na pang sweatshirt, at tsaka na ito, yung cotton na manipis. Ang problema kasi sa cotton, pag yun yung binili mo, again, parang kasi sa akin, dahil kasi I got on, diba? I got huge quads. So, wrong kasi siya sa chafing. Baka mamaya, after 5-10 uses, baka mamaya, sira na siya. Yeah, something I haven't missed. Long lines. Yeah. Endemic na nga. Endemic. Pick up. Pinay ka pang repair. So... I had those back in the day, you know, um, every Christmas then, pag nalabas siya. Those things are fire. Muy bien. Yeah, I therefore conclude na the pandemic made me an introvert. <laughs> Grabe. Hindi ako makikita. Ang daming tao. Nakakatawa lang. Dahil kasi, ano to? Checking out din yung ano, mga time lapses na kinukuha ko so far. It's pretty fun. Yeah. Yeah, nice. At least, sakto. Oras ng Pasko. Pilangan lang natin subaybayan ang pagbukas ng mga cinema. Ah, uh, let's pull it out a konti. Oh, look at that. That's beautiful. Damn. I always look forward to this kasi alternating between ito at saka yung sausage roll. So... Hindi ko siya malabas eh. Dahil kasi I think because of the mic. Ano, nung may microwave siya, sobrang lumambot. Kaya ka. Mmm. I was expecting a little bit more chicken, but I can't really complain. I mean, you can only give so much then. But yeah. for what it's worth, 155, 165, then. Okay, so change location. We're here in Rockwell. We're here in the Christmas tree. We're here in the pictures of the Range Rover. So, we're here in the Rover. My DMs are open. <laughs> Pupunta na tayo ng Met Gala eh. Okay, so nakalabas na kami. Yeah, shout out to Nila Holics, Glorieta Branch. <laughs> Sobrang okay. <laughs> Sobrang nakakatawa yung, ano, yung service. Kuela. So, yun. Ang cool lang pala. Dahil kasi yung nag-pedicure kasi sa akin, ano siya, um, five months pregnant. So, kung sakali man na nakita niya to, at some point, kung makikita ko man to, um, congratulations and best of luck on having a new kid. So, yun. Anyways, palag-palag. Pupunta siya Met Gala. 
Yeah. Okay, so nandito tayo ngayon sa Hoochie. Yeah. Yung um, Vietnamese food concept ng Moment Group. So, of course, when you're here, um, yung mga signature foods sa uh, Vietnam, of course, would be pho. Um, ano ba? Pho, banh mi. Yeah. Tapos, the things I've learned then from ano, uh, Sunny, dun sa Peppers. So, kung meron siya pipiliin na signature foods din dapat nandun would be bansyo. I don't think they have bansyo here. And, bakal muto ko yung iba eh. Yeah. And it actually got me thinking then parang recently yung content niya na parang gusto ko rin ito ay napuntan yung food I think pinag-offer ata kasi ng food tour sa Vietnam no usual food spots niya na Anthony Bourdain So depending on the city na lang I think meron natin particularly for Ho Chi Minh There's also a particular um Ito? There's a particular food tour din para for uh, Saigon nata So that's very promising That's very promising Kung sakaling pala rin or kung sakaling may free time na why not take it? Okay. As for me, I'm considering taking nanto. Uh, let's go with the basics. So I might take a uh, faba, faba. Tapos, I'm actually thinking then kung ako ng banh mi pero I remember the last time I had banh mi. Kung isama mo siya with fa, it's like nanto sandwich. Tapos you're eating yung ano lang, clear broth na noodles. And of course, since meron silang mango sticky rice, kuha natin to, di ba? Patikim ng Thailand, di ba? Needless to say, I'm excited to travel. So, order naman na tayo dahil kasi medyo hungry na mga tao dito. Tao being me. Guys, after much deliberation, baka mag-switch orders muna kami ni Atty. Um, ako yung magtatry ng Fa Prime, tapos siya yung magtatry ng Beef Fa dahil kasi ang benefit of the doubt, di ba? Yeah. First timer kasi siya eh, so... And I think sobrang unusual ng lighting that is sobrang low light na. As of right now, we're having a discussion ni Atty. when it comes to the differences between Asian cuisines. So, ang bias ko pa rin kung legit na, no? Kung legit na Asian cuisine. For me, Japanese. Yeah. Bias ko is Japanese. Kaya kasi, I think maliban lang dun sa it has to be, ano it has to be savory. And it doesn't have to be savory, pero it has to hit your ano, palate. Tapos at the same time, it has to be visib Anta? Um, visibly pleasing. aesthetic. Yan. Visibly aesthetic. Aesthetically pleasing. Tapos, um, it has to be aromatically good. Beauty and nutty and... It's a very... Just smelling yung broth right now, nitong ano, um, Pop Prime. Yeah. It takes me back to the ultimate, Anta, to the whole Ultimate Fanatic series. So, kung sakali man, I'm going to post it somewhere here. Right above my head. Tapos, kailan ako dati, parang, there was a time na parang, after nung shoot namin, parang sa Rated K, um, it was actually a while, bago ulit ako nakakain ng pho. Kaya kasi, <laughs> ikaw ba naman kasi, kumain ka ng 3 pounds, 4 pounds of pho in 7 minutes, 8 minutes. And, ano to, parang, sobrang sagat na yung capacity ko at the time. So, <laughs> Damn, dude. It actually takes me back. So, kung sakali man, uh, shoutout din sa Team Adam, kina Sir Leo, kay Ma Mix Chosa. So, sana, let's do business again. Yes. And I am excited para dito sa Fok. Yeah. I'm actually excited din to go to Vietnam. So, yun nga, going back dun sa plano na, ano, I might take yung food tour na, ano, mga food spots ni Anthony Bardeen. Apparently, there is a group that offers yung food tour na ganun. So, might look into that. Might look into that. Are they saying that she jumped the gun? So, how much time, bro? Very clean. Normally, kasi kina compliment siya with the sauces na may kita madon, or if not, sriracha. Yeah. Wait, let me try it with the sauces. Or fish sauce. Okay, so I am finally excited to try this. So. Um, of course, you have pho. Sa pho kasi, hindi nawawala yung rice noodles. Yes, very popular in Vietnam. It's very um, aromatic because of the um, aromatics na nakalagay. Number one na will, of course, be cilantro. Coriander. Gonna... The noodles are firm. Pero hindi siya like, firm na sobrang chewy. It actually melts, so... Ano ba? It's al dente. 
as is the broth is um, clear yeah it's very clear it's very light so alam niyo naman the philosophy with um, Vietnamese cuisine kasi parati siyang ano um, season to taste season to taste pero ikaw yung magsiseason nun so ang ginagawa kasi nila there's always a side of sauces for aromatics sa tabi tapos ikaw yung bahala mamili so we have here these three sauces so we have yung chili garlic niya you also have lime and you also have this I think tausi sauce sa tata or oyster sauce okay or hoisin yun hoisin sauce sa tata and you're expecting to season it your own like that so Siyempre, dahil kasi gusto natin yung spicy, lagay mo natin siya with spicy garlic as chili oil. So, mm, that's good. Good. But I think you could add more. And let's go to the beef rib. Lagay mo natin siya as Mmm, okay. It's very light. Um, the beef is well seasoned, um, very soft, okay in temperature. Kailangan mo again season to taste, so lagyan natin siya ng poison sauce. Wow! Holy crap, that works! Kasi nasa niyo yung ano, texture at saka yung ano, um, sauce ng Lichon Macau sa North Park. So from Pana. <laughs> wow. Okay. This is real good. Okay, so we're gonna go now with the spring rolls. The spring rolls me serve and uh, serve with a side of honey and peanut sauce. Okay. So don't know what peanut sauce. Honey? Vinegar. Sorry, vinegar pala. Okay. Pina kolpa. I think it would be better if we put sriracha in it. Let's try it in a little bit. For the heat. Mm. It actually gives you ano, it gives a different accent to the texture of the panalo. No wonder that it's in the tabi when you eat in every Vietnamese restaurant. Also with the side of MSG or fish sauce. Ano ang roof? Very Vietnamese thing. Broth. Fish sauce. Huh, oh, interesting. Okay. It's very light. Gulat ako ha. It's not like yung katulad nung... Siguro dahil kasi nasanay ako dun sa town namin, sa balaya, na parang yung fish sauce. Sobrang alat niya. Diba? Yung okay na, no? Yung okay na Ernie, Espiritu. Yeah, Ernie's Bagong. Yung sa kanila kasi, it's very... Okay. Suggest nyo na, Tony, try natin. Um, poison sauce. Lagyan natin ng konting lime. Lagyan din natin ng konting chung garlic kambi. Mmm! No, you mentioned in the sauce. Not the sauce. Sige. Okay, wala. Well, so far, yung kotek ko, panalo. Ito. Uh, Dip natin yung vinegar. Dip natin yung peanut sauce. Mmm! Okay. Very light in flavor. Okay, I'll have this giant piece. Real good. I'm not sure if this is a tradition in Vietnam too, but um, this is one in Japan, so I don't know. Screw it. We're gonna do it. Mm. Doko na sa sa broth yung fusion ng chili oil at saka ng lime oh my god that was good I'm sad I kind of want more parang gusto ko pa <laughs> but I think that's the thing kasi how to eat sticky mango rice so kuha ka ng mangga kuha ka ng konting 
sweet rice. Tapos, kuha ka ng konti coconut milk. Kuha natin siya na konti. You get a decent sized bite. Yeah. Really, really good. Really good. It's a perfect palate cleanser if you had something savory. Uh, tapos you want something to cancel that out. Panalo. Panalo. At least, ito naka-curb yung crave mo to try the real thing sa Thailand. Pero, if you had the chance, or if you have the chance to try this in Thailand, I seriously suggest you to. Panalo. Okay, so natapos na tayo dito sa food trip natin. Tapos, sumigating kami sa taas dun sa Pulipo. And I was thinking, ba meron kasi silang open copy dito ng Guinness World Records 2022. To my luck, wala. Oh, I have to admit, no? Ganun lighting dito. Hmm. Huh. Sana all day, every day. Or die. Okay. Ano daw? Ngayon, pauwi na kami. Um, attorney just got inside her grab. Yeah, so... Nandun siya sa ride niya and she's on her way home. Ako naman, just waiting for the driver to get here. Yeah, nakapagpok na yan naman ako. So, hey. pagbalik natin, we're just going to organize for the week. So, kung ano man yung magagawin natin. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of boring stuff. And a lot of training. Yeah. So, maliba lang sa water training. Sabi no, hindi mo makakalain na parang ngayon pa. As kung kailan na necessitate. Yeah, again, 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 again. Part of the job. Okay mga kalaman, nandito na ulit ako sa Taft. Um, buha pa lang ako. And right now, I'm actually taking a break dahil kasi nakakapagod. I mean, ganun lang ginawa namin. Naglakad lang along, 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 naglakad lang along Makati, uh, ano to? Um, Greenbelt, Glorieta, pagkatapos noon, numikat din along Rockwell, or at least loob ng power plant. So, hmm, interesting. Um, yung isa na rin siguro sa mga gusto kong gawin in the next, um, probably in the next few weeks, months siguro, or leading up to the new year, is umikot ulit ng pubs. So, publish on crawl tayo ng, nato umaga. So, it's going to be different dahil kasi we're going to see how much pubs grew up. Yes. <laughs> Ngayon, for me, um, ayos lang ako siguro ng gamit, um, probably fix my itinerary for the week. And then, move some stuff out of the way. And of course, manood ng full gear. Um, madami na ako nakita mga spoilers. Dahil kasi, alam niyo naman, smart fans, marks are... Smart marks are actually very... Hindi na kayang i-control ang mga sarili nila. So, okay lang. I appreciate it. Pero as expected, uh, congratulations sa ating AEW World Champion na bago. Cowboy S-Word. Hangman Adam Page. Right? So, yun naman na. Pahinga naman ako na konti. Balikan ko kayo siguro mamaya.